a random MAGA was kicked out of Trump's victory party in New Hampshire because he exposed that Alina Habba had clearly been lying about supposed COVID exposure, COVID symptom or whatever. This is a really bonkers story. OK, let me see if I can explain this. This isn't the biggest story, but it is very funny. Daily Beast reports ex Trump aide booted from victory party after photo with Alina Habba. What's going on? Dylan Quattrucci posted a photo with Trump lawyer Alina Habba just one day after she effectively called in sick to Trump's defamation trial. Let's look at the pictures. First picture here is Dylan Quattrucci posts to Twitter picture with Alina Habba just arrived at Trump's New Hampshire primary victory party and ran into the wonderful Alina Habba. Alina is President Trump's rock star attorney and a huge inspiration of mine. Moments later, Dylan Quattrucci posts, I was just kicked out of the Trump victory party for no reason. I was standing there speaking with other Trump supporters when I was asked to leave and pushed out of the venue. This is how they treat loyalty. What is this all about? Well, the Daily Beast believes that it knows. The photo that was posted was problematic for Habba and by extension, Dylan Quattrucci, uh, who was Trump's deputy state director in New Hampshire, because just a day earlier, Habba effectively asked a judge to delay the proceedings in Trump's E. Jean Carroll defamation trial because she was feeling unwell. After a juror called in sick, Habba told the judge Lewis Kaplan that her parents tested positive for COVID and that despite testing negative, she was experiencing symptoms. The judge had offered to continue with eight jurors, but Habba declined. She said she was feeling feverish and blah, blah, blah. So what is this about? What is going on here? Is it that Alina Habba was lying because she wanted to go to New Hampshire for Trump's victory party? Or is it that she's not lying and she went to the victory party anyway, exposing all sorts of people to what maybe is covid if she hadn't yet tested positive? It doesn't really matter because either way, she's a despicable person, which we already knew it was one or the other. Either Alina Habba was actually feeling fine, uh, but just didn't want trial so that she could be in New Hampshire with Trump or she was just going around spreading whatever she had. Maybe it was covid. Maybe it wasn't. And of course, who ends up being punished for the deception and the dishonesty of others? It's always random people. In this particular case, it's Dylan Quattrucci kicked out for posting a picture with Trump's lawyer.